or like very few here in the capital and it's being celebrated like few milestones have. Yeah, good evening to you, uh, Dan, and also Matty. Big occasion for the Raiders, Jared Croke. Sean Johnson continuing his terrific form. Adam Fanua Blake has been strong up front. There's so much to like about the team from across the Tasman. Here they come. Their away record pretty good. Three wins, three losses. His family is there in the guard of honour. The Warriors get the first bite at the Raiders. Here we go. One of the biggest nights here in years, and it's underway. There's Josh Papali'i carrying it forward. And their record from the 20 minute mark is outstanding. So the signs are good for them, but the Canberra side won't go away, that's for sure. Emre Gula played every game this year, and he's at the 30 metre line. There's Horsburgh to White. And he gives it to just a touch flat footed. Comes back here, Horsburgh. Back in the middle after a couple of weeks on the edge. Here's Timacore. Beautiful right foot step. Inside Pompey. Inside Ford. Then the offload. Whitehead comes to the middle. Inside the 10. Then finds the shoulder of Fanua Blake. Last tackle. Fogarty. White. The kick. That ricochets. That's a live ball. That's a try. It's Jack White who scores. And finally, the Raiders have crossed the line and got some points on the board. And of course, it's Jack White. He's a tackle buster. They come to the left-hand side of the field. A ricochet of Jack White and a perfect bounce. And finally, the Raiders have scored. They've had all the football, all the field position. And what a place to score. Right under the post for Jack White. It'll be 6-0 in favour of the Raiders. You could say there's a little bit of luck involved, but when you're this close and you pepper the line this many times, eventually something's going to happen like that. Jack White here, diving over like Steve Maven. And uh, you talk about Canberra Raider players in form. Ever since he announced he was leaving, he has been in top-notch. The 300 signs behind him. And he's on the board in game 300. But don't, don't write these Warriors off. They're not going anywhere. Oh, there's a shot. Now, Jackson Ford, apologetic. I mean, this might be a little bit of a head clash because he's holding his head here. Yep. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Guys, go away. So the bunker dealing with this. Oh, is that Barnett? Now, Barnett's got a history. Is it him with that left arm? Well, it looks across the shoulder from that angle, doesn't it, Block? Yeah, you're not allowed to hit in the head with any part of your body. I think I think the point of the shoulder, after the first point of contact, Ooh, yeah. has hit him on the chin here. Yeah. Ten. And you can argue block it could have been worse you can exactly no ball this in that would be enormous for Noah Blake to the 20. Johnson Nanik or Clockstad man on debut that's out it's up wants to go again well handled by Croker inside the 10 big old Clockstad Oh, he's well handled here. Two tackles remain. Now it's Johnson. Out to Egan. Here's Metcalf. And the man gives a two forward. Cut down. Fogarty with the tackle. Last. Oh, they dearly love six more here. Johnson. He put plenty on this. But Teddy Zalesniak! You see it, but you can't believe it! How has he contorted himself? Even for Dallin Watteni Zalesniak, that is quite simply unbelievable. Looked like he put a little bit too much on it, but it was pinpoint. Lesniak, look at that for a take. You won't see anything better than that. Look at oh, that. Oh, come on. Unbelievable. 
come on. He's got one of these in him every week, it seems. Look at him calling for it from Johnson. Hopawati caught in field. What a take. You won't see anything better than that. How good are the wingers these days at finishing? My goodness. And that one. Oh, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Six Ooh. points all. That, that's a try only he could score, you would imagine. That kick. I wonder if that was the plan to put it that high up. Because... If it's pinpoint, only with Tenny Zalesian could have gone up and got it. Hopper Whitey couldn't have got it there with him. Hello, Horsburgh. With Tenny Zalesian. You can't blame him at all. And Croker, two from two tonight. So the Raiders back out in front, eight points to six. Salo first to meet him. Here's Harris. Johnson wants it. Johnson flicks it. Egan keeps it going. Nigel Klockstad, the little runaround play. Egan's kick, that'll be six more. The hand stuck up by Croker, and now going through, Lamb Tower. Oh, just taken down. Chris saves it, but a full set for the Warriors. Out there, they swarm in the Raiders. So now it's Canberra's turn to defend their line. No hurry to get off here. Barnett at first receiver, they know he's going to run. Horsburgh there, so is Starling. So is Whitehead. Back it comes now, Johnson. That was a bullet out of dummy half there. Big old Crookstar goes himself and scores. Big old Crookstar scores on his old home ground. And the Warriors take the lead. Nick Crookstar, as I said, is always involved in the play. This time, the 300 game man. That was always the worry. They're a skillful side, aren't they? Look at that speed. Just skips on the outside. Crookstar. What about the engine on this boat? Always involved in the game. Just uses his pace to get on the outside of Croker. And the Warriors are first to score in the second half. Well, they know what he's all about, the Canberra faithful. This man was superb in his four years here, 66 games. An outstanding performance in the grand final. But... Uh, this has silenced the crowd. This is as silent as the crowd has been all night. They've earned this, the Warriors. And he's heard these before. He kick one from the sideline in the first half. And he makes it. Warriors 12, Canberra 8. Warriors ball. Oh, there's a hit from Ruppin. Not that it matters, but both sides have a buy after this week, so they can absolutely empty the tank. This is beautiful ball movement now as Poppy sends his man Metcalf down the sideline. Links up with Nicole Clockstar. Gets it on the inside to Pompey. How is Nicole Clockstar covering all this crowd? Warriors now. Looking to click in the gear. Now tie up. Up to the 20 metre line. Egan looking left. He's got Johnson. Johnson gets it on. Here's a run. Haven't seen much of that from Metcalf. Just involving himself now. Oh, beautiful pass. Tom Ali crashes over. And the Warriors get another. Oh, Tohu Harris with the pass. Ali flying through. Nia Kore is going to be the man that's going to make the bus there on that right-hand side. Clockstar, as you mentioned, is everywhere. But just sit back and watch his second man play. Soft hands. That's a great run. Back-to-back -back tries for the Warriors. They're a dangerous football side. They've hang on all first half. Go in at half time. Behind on the scoreboard. Look at this. Looking to go out the back. Hits the front man. And they're not going to stop him that close to the line. First career try. Tom Arlett. It's taken him a little while to get going in the NRL. So Johnson. Now the crowd really is murmuring. And the lead balloons. Biggest of the night. Warriors 18 to 8. Manny Russell talked about all the great wins they've had on the road this year. This could be top of the list really. Consider all the emotion for the Raiders. And the Raiders are in outstanding form as well. They're no chumps. 10 up.
17 to play. Johnson really running the show in this second half as he feeds it on to Fenua Blake. So the big boppers on both sides now back out there. Siren, early ball for Johnson. Here's the hook box start. They create numbers as Watemi Zaluzniak goes to ground. No tower. Middle clock that last tackle. Johnson on the run. Oh, what a ball! What a pass! Sumptuous from Sean Johnson. And it's Luke Metcalf who scores. But that is all. Sean Johnson. Watch how many blokes could score here. Oh, geez, that replay doesn't tell us much, does it? Here's the angle that might. Well, Has he uh, been collected by it? I think this is an accidental head clash of so This might be friendly fire. I think he might have just caught the... Oh, OK. Oh, well, it's not friendly fire, but it's accidental with yeah. Whitehead there. Yes. A and now... Just as well they scored. They're unstoppable. It was 8 6 at half time. It's now the Warriors Ooh. running away. 24 to 8. Now they might need some deft touch here. Metcalf calling the shots. Egan to that man, Metcalf. Now that's been played at. Or has it? Six, again. Six more tackles. It has been played at. Warriors can just about put this to bed. Canberra on the ropes. Warriors showing no mercy. Out it comes. Barnett to the 10. Egan. Egan goes himself and strolls over. Oh, it's the Warriors' night tonight. This has been a class performance. And the Warriors are doing it in style. And throws the dummy. It's a little bit slow to move from Marker there, Papalihi. But they're very tired through the middle. They're getting blasted through the middle here. Just looked at the man back on the inside. There's the dummy. It was near a Corey just sprinting onto the ball. He just used him up. Players in motion again. So Pompey makes the kick. And this lead now 30 to 8. Harris, Ben Carr, running a hard line forward, but Fogarty down low with the tackle. Ball comes out. Now it's Jordan Rapina collected heavily. Oh. Right of him. And in the bin. Yep. Had to be. Had to be. So a second sin bin. Wouldn't they love to stand their ground a second time with a man in the bin? Six more tackles. That makes it harder. Here's Papali'i. Papali'i crashes over. Just Papali'i. Looks like he scored. Yes, no question there. No question he got that down. Yeah, I reckon, I reckon you get a tape of him scoring 20 or 30 of them, I believe. They cause trouble. I'll tell you what, I like Marshall King back. I think he's near on their best player for the Dolphins, so he's back into the side. And the hammer back too, so, yeah. gee, I, I can't see how Manly have got a big start there. Yeah. Tom Gilbert's a ball! Oh, intercept try! It's Sean Johnson! No wonder he wanted to come back on! He never scored a try like this. It was a sloppy pass at best. Straight away from the kickoff. To try and move the ball. Oh, oh my golly. Johnson can't believe it. <laughs> so it looks like the Warriors are going to be the last to score here. A devastating second half. And a massive crowd has really made this such an event. And the Warriors have stood up to it and flourished and won. And won in style. The Warriors are for real. Jared Croker will have better nights.
The Warriors get better and better. Full time in the capital. Warriors 36, Canberra 14.